Hello, my name is Olivia Immett, and I am the program leader here at Cumberland Falls State Resort Park. Welcome to the first edition of Recreational Reading. I named it this for three reasons. The first being, I work in the Recreation Department here at Cumberland Falls. The second being, Recreational Reading is a term that is used for people who enjoy reading so much that they pick out books that interest them and read it in their free time. And the last but not least, the reason why I named this Recreational Reading is that I will show you a craft at the end of each book that relates to the book that we will read. And the book that we are reading today is The Icky Sticky Frog. On a pretty blue lake, on a big brown log, sat a very quiet little green frog. A fly flew by. Shh! The frog did not make a sound. He just eyed the fly flying around. Whoop! Out came the frog's tongue so sticky and long and slurp! The fly was gone. Just as the frog was swallowing the fly, a colorful beetle came crawling by. Shh! The frog did not make a sound. He just eyed the beetle crawling around. Whoop! Out came his tongue so sticky and long and slurp! Now beetle was gone. The frog swallowed the beetle like he swallowed the fly. Then a green grasshopper came hopping by. Shh! The frog did not make a sound. He just eyed the grasshopper hopping around. came his tongue so sticky and long and slurp. Now the grasshopper was gone. Frog swallowed the grasshopper hopping by like he swallowed the beetle and he swallowed the fly. Then he saw a pretty butterfly. Shh! The frog didn't make a sound. He just eyed the butterfly flying around. Whoop! Out came his tongue so sticky and long. Go! Now the frog was gone. I hope you have enjoyed that book. Now let's take a look at the craft that relates to this book. The items that you will need for this craft include green tissue paper, one small paper plate, two small paper circles, one party favor blowout, one pair of scissors, one glue stick, and if you have it, a hot glue gun. To begin the craft, Take your paper plate and fold it in half. Now you're going to take your scissors and you're going to cut a hole in the very middle of the paper plate. When you open it, it should look like this. Close it back up and take your party favor Put it in between the paper plate and have the mouthpiece come out of the hole that we cut. Now this is where the hot glue gun comes in handy. You are going to take the hot glue gun 
and glue the paper plate shut. You don't need a hot glue gun, uh, but it does make it a little bit easier because you don't have to wait as long. Once it is glued shut, it should look like this. The next step is to take your green tissue paper. If you don't have green tissue paper, you can also use a green marker. And you are going to decorate your soon to be frog. Take your glue stick and glue the strips of the paper onto the paper plate. Now, after you have made your entire paper plate green, it's time to add the eyeballs. Take your two round paper circles and glue them on to the top of your paper plate. Now there's one last ingredient that I forgot to list at the beginning, and that is a marker to draw the pupils of the frog. Now let's make them come to life. Thank you for joining me for this edition of Recreational Reading. Hope to see you next time.